Hello everyone, and welcome to this unboxing video for Kingdom Death's Death High Archivist. This is the most recent Death High model, and was released with the early January models. Now, sadly, I didn't manage to get any of the other models. In fact, I got this in the set that was posted after it. I just ended up missing the sale entirely. I really would have liked one of the new generic models. Can't even remember which one it was. But let's get to this. So, first we've got her small art card. Nice. Slyish? Nice smile. The interesting necklace and such. And then on to her full art card, which again is just a larger or more pulled out view of the full image. Same one, of course. I don't know if this one has a weapon on her. Might be somewhere like behind her or something or hanging out of her bag. But as with all the Death Eye models thus far, it's a single space model in the brown orangish 3D printed resin. Again, still not sure how I feel about resin. Definitely comes out with much better details, but it's so fragile. This stuff is less fragile than the pure resin, and that's less fragile than some things that I've seen from other companies. Alright, so she is actually four pieces, and I think that's the most for a Death High model thus far. There is a majority of her, and she's got her messenger bag. I prefer messenger bags. A bunch of things hanging off her belt. Like, she's got an almost utility belt-like thing. Part of me was like, is one of those a grenade? No, it looks more like a pencil case or something. I don't know if it's pencils coming out of the top or the line, uh, the excess plastic resin that comes from the printer, the lines to stabilize things. Then she's got her backpack, which actually goes on the base of the model, not on her back. It's actually a really good looking backpack and everything. Uh, you can even... See the various books or pieces of paper in there. Again, I apologize about my camera. And has class and everything. Ooh, even a nice little face thing on right there. The oddball bulge there is actually a tiny mask-like face. Then we've got her arm that wasn't attached. And it is the full arm holding a book. which is more reminiscent of the actual archivist model, if I recall correctly. And then we've got her head, which also includes this area. I can't remember what that's called. The pendant is there in full detail. I mentioned that because, again... Uh... Oh, hey, there's the auto-zoom. How long will it last? In fact, now you can see it. And yeah, just so much detail, like, on the major lock of hair. Let me see if I can get some other stuff up. But that was actually the entire model. Again, I apologize about my zoom being very finicky and not being able to be manually set it. But if people would like to see this in full detail, please leave a comment and I can either do a close-up video of just this and others. I would, If I was just showing them off, I'd actually likely mix them together. Or I can do a painting video, which would result in showing off the details up close. Regardless, that's all for now. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, feel free to press that like button. If you think somebody else will enjoy this, please share this video. Either way, you'll help this video get seen more. If you didn't like this video, go ahead and press the dislike button. I won't mind, but please leave a constructive comment as to why. Also, feel free to comment in general, such as the things I mentioned earlier, other stuff involving Kingdom Death Monster, or seeing any of my models painted earlier specifically ones that I've shown off on the channel, such as the other Death High models. And if you'd like to see more like this, be it my unboxing videos, my board game overviews, or my painting videos, all three of which I tried to do for Kingdom Death, and I do have the Ringtail Fox Death High painting video up, feel free to subscribe. Regardless, thank you for watching, and have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.